question I'm very often asked is how do I adjust the pH of my soil because the plants I'm planting are acid loving. Now we could go into great great technical depth but I'm going to give you the answers, how to do it, why to do it and what to use. So let's start off by what are acid loving plants. Primarily there's a group of them and you can identify them on one hand literally. Those would be gardenias, whether they're the ground covers, the mid-height or even the large shrubs, azaleas or rhododendrons, all types of those, and camellias. And of course, the most contentious of them all are hydrangeas. Adjusting the pH of your soil can be done by using mulches. And that would be using pine mulch, bark nuggets, but that takes a very, very long time. And ultimately, we don't have that time when we've got these plants in our garden that we want to be in the perfect conditions, which is when this guy comes along, which is an acid-loving plant food. The bottom line is when using this product, you adjust your pH of your soil to between 5.0 and 6.0. That is when this group of plants optimally grows. Very often, plants that need acid-loving soil will often have an iron deficiency. And this is identified simply by a yellowing of the leaves. And you find it very prevalent in gardenias. In fact, if you have to feed your gardenias with a chemical fertilizer, they react in the same way, which is why it's better to use an organic fertilizer and then supplement it with the acid-loving plant food. Acid-loving plant food is applied as a granule simply sprinkled around the plant. What it's composed of is 40% aluminium sulfate, 40% ferrous sulfate, which is the iron element, and sulfur. In fact, if you take a good sniff of it, you can smell the sulfur. The benefits of using the acid-loving plant food are very easy to understand. Number one, we know we're adjusting the pH. When adjusting the pH, you're improving the respiration and the photosynthesis of the plant. Especially in hydrangeas, because of the aluminium sulfate, in the acid-loving plant food, you are guaranteed to have blue hydrangeas. It also helps the plant to remain disease-free and highly vigorous throughout the growing season. The acid-loving plant food should always be used in conjunction with the slow-release fertilizer, preferably organic. Applying the acid-loving plant food is really easy. It's 40 grams, which is four of these guys. One of these scoops is 10 grams, four of these sprinkled around the plant and into the root zone and the root zone be it a pot would be the entire area with the plant any acid loving plant it would be where the leaves stop follow a line down right up to the base of the plant so that can be quite a large area just sprinkle it around so it would be four of these guys and then a good watering and you would do that every five weeks well, there you have it, folks. Everybody gets so confused about acid soil, alkaline soil. If you have acid-loving plants, simply use this plant food and you'll get the right adjustment, the perfect conditions ready for the plants.